In the years following the 2011 revolution, political instability and regional security concerns have taken a significant toll on the Egyptian economy, especially on tourism. Now, the economy is facing three interlinked issues, an urgent balance of payments problem, rising public debt, and low growth and high unemployment. So, with overall investment and exports down, growth has not been strong enough to create jobs for the 700,000 young people entering the workforce every year. The Egyptian authorities have designed an economic reform plan to unleash the potential of Egyptian economy and better serve its people. The IMF wants to support that plan. So the executive board has approved a $12 billion loan. The Egyptian designed reforms are part of a carefully crafted package that is intended to revive growth and make sure that it produces lasting changes and inclusive growth. The key objectives for the authorities under the program is to restore confidence in the Egyptian economy through monetary and exchange rate policy reform and strong fiscal consolidation to ensure public debt sustainability. Far-reaching structural reforms are another key component of the program. For example, reducing energy subsidies will help to free up resources for spending in priority areas such as health, education, and improving the public infrastructure. These policies are all aimed at stabilizing the economy and boosting growth. But what about the Egyptians? How will the homegrown program benefit them? One of the key guiding principles of the Egyptian program is to actually strengthen safety nets in order to protect the most vulnerable. For example, one of the measures aims to increase spending on food subsidies and targeted cash transfers to the elderly and poor families. These reforms are not easy. They will take time to generate gains, benefits, but it's really worth the journey because by implementing them, going through the process, we'll actually unleash the potential of the Egyptian economy and will serve its people. The IMF, together with the international community, is ready and prepared to walk that journey of reforms with the Egyptian people, with the Egyptian authorities, and we look forward to its success.